Herb days. Now this is the schedule for a normal school year. Basically, yellow day, yellow days are public holidays. White days are schools are open to people, and red days are bank holidays. I have no idea what green dates are. Oh, green dates are weekends. Yay! When summer holiday happens, lots of things seem to happen. Now, we always get lots and lots of great days and ideas, but for some reason, lots of people seem to have some, well, things to happen too. It's said that the Bush government is considering changing their school term dates in, well, Wales. In November of 2021, a guy named Mark Drakeford said that the school terms should be changed so that school terms and holidays should be equal and that they should have equal lengths and times. Basically, he's literally trying to say that we're doing everything he could so that he can make, he can balance out holidays and school days. But I will have to argue with him because, well, we have more rest days than school days. What do you want me to do? Yeah? Yep, 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 quack, 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 smack. Yeah, that's all that seems to happen throughout the whole school year. In the UK and regular school, it's actually divided into three terms. The fall term, the spring term, and then, like, yeah, then the winter term, too, I guess that you could say. The winter holidays seem to happen, too. However, we, their longest holiday is summer, and the longest term is the fall term, or autumn term, depending how you want to call it. And during the summer, some people do a summer slide, meaning they completely take out the information they learned in school, and they decide to be, yeah, I'm dumber than I was before. Yay, let's go and chant this trident to a loyalty, too. Or let's go play Hasbro. Or let the, let the procrastinating monkey say, yo, ah, ah, oh, ah, ah, we're gonna do YouTube. And like, yeah, all that stuff. And so now it's the big time for the bit. Let's see if the affirmative position has anything to say. Well, according to me, more equal terms and holidays are better for children from disadvantaged backgrounds who go on the, as they say, summer slide, where the brain expels information. Plus, Christmas and Easter are a great time for families and friends, so there should be more time to enjoy it too. Parents and guardians wouldn't also need to spend so much money during the summer while they're at work. Like, you're working on this day, and then you're spending, spending, spending so much money. I mean, is it so hard? Is it so good? Oh, you, you, don't you just want to send more? I feel like I'm an advert person. I'll probably never get a sponsor on this channel. The thing is, that's a pretty awesome number. I object! Current day should be changed because the long summer holiday is the best thing about being young. It's a time for adventure and the outdoors. It's the dark January days that people look forward to during summer break. Summer break is that long wanted break that will not be freed until they actually do some proper work. Bing! And it's like a reward. Summer is also when most families go on their main holidays, so it actually makes sense to make a big holiday and to not go to school during that day. However, this time the results are a little different. 80% for the negative position, and a teeny weeny 20% for the affirmative position. So, they're saying, turn dates should change. Not? But bum 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 term date should not change. We shall keep on going with this term date. I love you guys so much because I also agree with the negative position. So I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Shana now peace. The end See you guys next time.